the Christmas pageant. We must be careful how Donald Miller is used in the pageant. What about Donald Miller? We must be careful in the pageant that we neither hide Donald Miller nor put him forward. Because of the colour of his skin? That's right, yeah. Why? Oh, come on, Father. I think he should be treated like every other boy. Well, you yourself have singled the boy out for special attention. You held a private meeting with him at the rectory. About a week ago? Yes. What are we talking about? Donald Miller. The boy acted strangely when he returned to class. Did he? Well, when he returned from the rectory, a, a little odd, yes. Can you tell us why? How did he act strange? He... Well, I'm not sure how to explain it. He laid his head on the desk and he had some... So you were given an impression? Yes. And he was returning to the, from the rectory. So you're asking me? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> That's it. Hmm. Mm. Are we discussing the pageant? That's why I'm here. Why are we discussing this? This. Well, I feel uncomfortable. Why? What do you think? The boy's well-being is my responsibility. The boy's well-being is not the issue. I'm not satisfied that that is true. He was upset when he returned to class. Did he say anything? No. What happened in the rectory? Happened? Hmm. I had a talk with the boy. What about? A private matter. He's 12 years old. What could be private? I resent your tone. This is not about my tone. Or your tone, Father Flynn. It's about arriving at the truth. About what? You know what I'm talking about, don't you? You're controlling the expression on your face right now, aren't you? My face? What exactly are you accusing me of? I'm not accusing you of anything, Father Flynn. I am asking you to tell me what happened in the rectory. I don't feel like continuing this. And if you're dissatisfied, I encourage you to go to Monsignor Benedict. I can only imagine that this unfortunate behaviour is due to overwork. Good morning, sister. Sister.